Hello, hello, and welcome back to Leaky Gaming, and welcome back to a new episode of We Don't Have Any Power. We're losing power, we need power. Right, uh, we need power, and uh, I really don't want to continue building these power plants. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking that we're gonna have to build the wind turbines. What's our power consumption? 47 and massively growing. Mm. Yeah, well, there, there's no other option. We will have to go with uh, uh, windmills because we don't have enough. Uh, yeah, maybe maybe another coal plant. What about our finances? What if we increase? What if we increase this by 50%? Is this gonna provide us with a little bit more power? Yeah, yeah, it, it, it's, it's, it's providing power. Okay, this is temporary solution to our problem. I'm not really sure if this is, seriously, only like only 10. I increased financing by 50% for our electrical grid. And we only got 25% increase in power. Well, fine, obviously it's how it works. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, like, you can't get more than what you can get. And uh, what's what about this? Okay, yeah, this looks like a grid issue, so... Water supply. Here we go, good people. There we go. Okay, so what do we have? We have a few commercial zones, a request for commercial zones. Uh, this is our hilltop uh, community. I'm gonna develop it all the way here. And probably I'll build a little bit more, or maybe I can, no, you know what? This is what we're gonna do. Top side of this is gonna be commercial and the lower side is gonna be housing. And let's see how this is going to work out. This is our posh area. Posh. Only the posh people live here. And yeah, can we do the specialization of this? Housing special? Is this? No. What is this? Commercial specialization and um, residential. Uh, yes. Yes. Self-sufficient buildings. This is going to wreak havoc on our area here it's gonna be rebuilding houses i'm well aware this is gonna cause some problems for us but unfortunately <clears throat> i would like to get this resolved as soon as possible and uh, yeah this is gonna be our up um, like uh, our better community uh, consuming less uh, power and um, i'm looking forward to this being developed uh, we are okay financially so I'm happy with that and I'm gonna make a new living zone here. It's also gonna be connected somewhere here Okay, let's do something like this, but I wouldn't want to mix it and uh, just so the zones stay separate Okay Okay. Something a little bit like this, maybe. obviously we're on running low on finances and uh, <clears throat> more so we're gonna have to uh, sponsor the new uh, water supply system here I mean we probably have enough water but uh, yeah maybe this came in the wrong time this decision I made like people are like yeah you know no poop because it's um we, we have power kind of we're running uh, actually no no uh, reconstruction oh come on okay done done 
Right. Uh, I built the roads. That's fine. Uh, probably should build houses as well. Let's uh, t take a district here. This is our subhill district, or I don't know how to call it. Prospect Park. I'm going to rename all of those. And uh, yeah, here we're gonna have just just a standard thing, standard. Um, most of the uh, centers or intersections are gonna be covered by commercial areas as well as our rest of it is gonna be residential. So let's put something like this here, and maybe yeah, why not? Uh, as long as we're building, let's let's do it like this. Okay, this looks good. Now let's start with the housing. Maybe I should use a different... Uh... <laughs> this is horrible. Eh, what you gonna do? It's fine. No, 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 I think this one is, was better. Okay, so we have some... Oh yeah, the water system. This is gonna be so much fun, catching up with the water system and it starts blinking everywhere and me becoming more nervous. Build more water, build more water. We need to build parks as well because our people um, demand those things in order to... to uh, continue growing so we gonna water first actually surprisingly most of it is already covered by water system so let's not overextend ourselves or overspend this doesn't have to be extended right water you have uh power you'll get as soon as people start moving in okay greenhouses are being built here guys oh this looks really beautiful view from here oh the swamps everywhere okay so what's next <laughs> okay people are moving in yeah, I think we need to address the power issue. No, I don't want to address the power issue. The, is it all uh, is it, is it all commercial? Yes. We need the power should... Oh, yeah, here we go. Power issue has been resolved. Right. Uh, so this is going to be our shopping district or of Prospect Park. Um, these little houses here. What is this? Bowling alley? General store. Uh, general store yakisoba that's obviously japanese two yakisobas next to each other this is not smart business guys oh three yakis maybe they're just uh, commercials maybe they're just uh, sorry advertisements go nuts and donuts <laughs> big bite nice oh big bite is just here right uh we need uh, what else what else so uh, we have basic coverage for them let's see what they require especially people around this area here i like them uh they're growing nice and steady uh yeah they need more happiness and more happiness is going to be provided by your lord mayor okay so let's see what the parks have to offer parks and plazas okay it's it's fairly fairly horrible S slope too steep is it gonna be all the way like that yes this is gonna have to be put in a more flat area so what about here This could be a good place to place it, but unfortunately, yeah, what you gonna do? Okay, so this one is covering this area, and let's see what else we have here. We have small playground. Let's put small play playground <clears throat> in this part of the city here, and we need the one more park. Do we have something? Oh, Japanese gardens. I like Japanese gardens. 
and this Japanese garden is gonna have to be somewhere unfortunately looks like we're gonna have to demolish something sorry there we go okay uh, actually oh, two more guard how much is oh no money okay uh, we're gonna have to earn money I would like to uh, increase the quality of the industrial area as well so what's with the power generation here so we have uh, 50 megawatts and suddenly oh yeah the houses changed here so they're not consuming so much electricity anymore so yeah this is actually still it was a good decision to do it but we lost some money we lost some population we are recovering slowly okay yeah this still has to be connected with uh, power lines <clears throat> let's see uh what else do we have here we obviously can expand the city now but uh financially we are still kind of recovering and i'm already thinking about what is this not enough educated workers okay so schooling system of course uh what do we have institute of creative arts uh this is a prestigious school specializing in creative arts educates teens an alternative to high school hmm, high school twenty-four thousand. 560 per week this is more expensive but it takes less of a maintenance and uh, student capacity 800 student capacity 1000 i think i should go with this one but let's see this high school is how many i i, I need to check the statistics um, education <clears throat> uh we have Okay, high school. One high school would be enough. Uh, we need uh, one more elementary school, one high school, and a university is still not extremely needed, but uh, would be a good uh, thing to have uh, soon in the future. So elementary, uh, elementary school or high school? How was the price? This is ten thousand and uh, sorry, uh, twelve thousand, and this is thirty thousand yeah i think this is a uh, institute of creative arts is a better choice because in the long run it's going to save us money capacity at the moment is not uh, not highly required so it's going to be fine oh i think this is consuming less water 240 640 and this one is oh no actually it's consuming more huh that's interesting Should we then well later on we're not gonna have uh, power issues so I, I think I'm gonna go with a better quality one but do we go for you know what we're gonna build both so uh, I'm gonna go with uh, elementary school first <clears throat> uh, oh switch what's with the switch oh power uh, what's with the power oh no power uh, power plants we still can't build this one we will be able to do it soon but unfortunately uh, let's compensate with uh, with uh, there we go yes does it need water i have a feeling it needs water doesn't need water that's good uh let's see now okay water system should be resolved now yeah it is what else do we have okay not enough educated workers yeah uh, i mean it's obvious what we're gonna do now <clears throat> uh we're gonna build either community school sorry we're gonna build a uh, elementary school this is only two thousand more but again i think it's consuming more power is it no actually in this case this one is better uh <clears throat> 160 uh, cubic meters of water per week and 320 electricity yeah it's consuming less so i might go for a second community school and it's less maintenance per week okay <clears throat> as a community school we're gonna go or should we go for a high school yeah high school uh, demand is growing so high school is gonna be this one 
which we are kind of close maybe not is this per week yeah this is per week this is gonna take several weeks for us to get this kind of money uh okay let's leave it as it is let's try to collect money for the high school we have too many high school um uh workers or like our children eligible for high school and we have one elementary school so we have some kind of supply for uh, for workforce so technically in time all should resolve itself it won't because so always kids are being born so we're gonna need more and more and uh, high school yeah i think i should slowly <clears throat> start planning not to put schools or, or these government buildings near these roads because I think they're gonna create a lot of problems for us. Here we go. Okay, so we have this high school here. We put it here or somewhere around this area. Yeah, this is this is not the uh, <laughs> let's call it a nice school. Uh, this is more efficient school. So let's put it two to two. Yeah, looks like this is the best option anyway. Maybe I should upgrade the road first. Okay, let's upgrade this road first. Um, slow it down. F uh, no, yeah, slow it down. Let's build a big avenue here, or at least start constructing one. So we're gonna put. Um, no. When are we gonna get this? Not anytime soon. What about here? Later on. Yeah, let's let's upgrade this for four to four lane road. So plonk plonk. Hopefully it's not gonna require yeah. Uh, let's build a school here. Uh, hopefully this is gonna be okay. So let's go with this one and high school on this main road. Plonk. Here we go. Voila, guys, 1,000 places for high school education. You're welcome. We're bankrupt again. So this is probably going to create a lot of uh, positive effects here because a lot of people <clears throat> down the line... Oh, uh, yeah. A lot of people down the line are going to require well-educated people. Here we go. You see, educated, well-educated. Actually, we have well-educated. Where did you get that? We don't have well-educating facilities what about this one three oh okay this is what it requires so this is what we have this is what it requires okay yeah we need the uh, higher educated people uh high school uh, should um, take care of that to a huge extent it's ugly how it looks here but we'll try to work with it uh okay uh we can purchase we can, we can expand so what does this offer us uh nothing much there's some agricultural area here some ores here what about this one this one has only forests 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 and ores this is agricultural land here and forests so do we start exploiting this no probably gonna keep it uh for later so two two eight two nine three and four eight okay now uh, that's quite expensive let's uh, let's not do it now okay uh, let's continue on so what do we have here um this is still not improving a lot of our citizens are sick but you you have one health care death care okay uh healthcare clinic six citizens 200 capacity wow this costs 120,000 wow no way <laughs> not building that anytime soon wow okay the hospital <laughs> we're gonna treat you guys don't worry about it okay so we're collecting money for the hospital now we're closing in we're closing in to the good number and uh, i think the most affected people well technically everywhere yeah maybe i should have um 
organize this better and leave some space here but it doesn't matter even if we close something uh, here we go it fits here perfectly so one of them can be plonked in he into here but uh, I would like to develop this area more so than any other uh, because um, I'm, I'm, I'm I have high hopes for this area and uh, what do we have here okay we can we can build it now but let's see where we can build it where it doesn't affect the a lot of buildings um, two buildings here uh, ah, fine here we go uh, let's see if this is gonna help our people uh, yeah I'm not even sure now because it calculates here yeah we ain't gonna need more it calculates here that uh, you know in the in the whole capacity of the city so I'm not really sure if this is necessary to put it like in the city center maybe it can be somewhere on the side I'm still learning um, it's always a learning especially with the really nice and good games like this it's always a learning curve that you have uh, in order to to have the best practices to to get to know the game and uh, you know the, to learn how to play it the best. Uh, you, you you'll never learn. You'll never learn. That's that's motivation for me for me right there. Um, right. Uh, we do. Wow. Six citizens are. Okay. This is not good. What's our population? Oh no. This is not good news. So we need some money. Our finances are falling down like a London bridge. Uh, we have more capacity though, so average health is improving. So we should have this resolved in the future. But we're still collecting. Okay, uh, there we go. We're recovering, at least financially. So this area is becoming yeah a bit better uh, and I would like to put one of them maybe on this side because it looks like it's the most endangered part of our town so let's see we have a couple of closures here so maybe somewhere around here as soon as we have money which is uh, quite soon oh which is not here we go okay our capacities are increased to 300 um, uh, heal capacity 300 so this is this is going to improve our average uh, health uh, maybe I'm not even going to build a third one because this should lower our sick citizen number down because technically now we have 20% of population being quite sick yeah uh, we'll see how this improves 300 I believe was um, was quite okay number also we should consider that care uh, so we should consider uh, where is it? Cemetery or... Can we even build that now? No, no. Uh, more residential zones. No, 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 guys. We're not building more residential zones. We already have enough issues as it is. Um, they need to be... Like, go and live with where the people that are not healthy live. So everything's gonna be fine it's gonna be fine guys it's it's okay 47 there you go <clears throat> like I said the the sick citizen number is uh, shrinking and it's probably gonna continue to shrink uh, as we progress <clears throat> so I'm gonna leave it as it is like this uh, kind of this clinic covers this part of the city um, yeah and there's a lot of empty houses everywhere so hopefully that's gonna recover as well <clears throat> financially we are doing uh, we're, we're fine not more than fine oh this is uh, large buildings small buildings and buildings okay i'm gonna leave this area for now uh trash coverage is fine uh garbage processing oh we don't have any recycling uh, or anything like that uh that's something we should consider uh health again um no I, I think i'm gonna stick to this because health is uh improving generally uh a little bit of a crime issue here and a little bit of a fire hazard issues maybe if we build a new fire station somewhere around here we still have electrical issues 
Yeah, maybe we should build. You know what? Uh, what's our electrical situation? So we have 63 electrical. Oh, oh yeah, we have the windmill. Uh, I was wow. Okay, we increased our electrical production, but uh, no. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll wait for the 19,000, which is just around the corner, and I'm gonna plonk the big uh, power plant, the big dirty power plant right next to this big dirty power plant. There we go. Uh, this is gonna help us a bit. So, oh, here we go. The nice ones. And no. They have capacity of 200. Unfortunately, looks like we need deeper water. Okay, uh, what else do we have? What about oil? Oil, oil. We need 5,000. Okay, so let's let's do this. Let's plonk another coal, dirty one. Uh, that's gonna take care of our electrical issue. That's one thing. Second thing, uh, crime. Crime is uh, quite... Oh, no, this is fire safety. Fire safety needs to be addressed. So we're going to build another fire station somewhere. I would go around here. This could cover... Yeah, yeah I see smiley places there. Let's let's consider this covered. Um, yeah, and this also... Let's, let's just ignore the red parts. Uh, police force. Police force. Crime rate is quite low, and yet uh, we have some kind of complaints. And uh, what's with this house? This house obviously got wrapped. Oh, okay, so jails. Detained criminals 19, jails capacity 20. So that should be fine, right? My math is like a bit rusty, but uh, yeah, that should be fine. Crime rate is low. Uh, I'm gonna leave it here. So this is this is all fine. So let's see how we can improve the rest of the situation in the city. I'm not gonna build. We have uh, almost three thousand people, and I believe that we have enough capacity uh, for our people here. For example, this one is being upgraded, right? Yeah. Let's see what is gonna be upgraded to. I I bet it's gonna be something like this one here. Yes, it's similar. It's quite, it's quite similar. It's not the same. It's quite similar. Uh, but yeah, yeah, I like when they do the grass on the rooftops. That's that's quite nice. Okay, I can buy new lands, but I'm not gonna do it as of yet. I'm gonna try to use the money we have. Uh, okay, here we go. Uh, it's it started, people. It started uh, traffic jams. So we're gonna have to consider moving this. So can we just move this? Relocate building. Or relocate cost. Okay, fine. I'm I'm happy with that. I mean, not with this price, but uh, let's do this. Relocate price. Fine. Why? Why would you be sad? Uh, medical clinic. Oh yeah, I'm gonna relocate this and this because every neighborhood has their own clinic. So I'm gonna put this one somewhere. Well, should we have these sick people here? Or these here? There you go. How dare you be sick? Okay, uh, that's number two. We have two more to go. We have firehouse. Let's see if we can relocate this building somewhere more efficient. So, yeah, it looks like everywhere we have an issue with fire safety. So, maybe it would be the best to keep it somewhere around here. Yeah, let's just move it here. And uh, the last thing is police station. So, okay, let's try upgrading this road first. And let's move the police station. There we go. Relocate the building. Same place. Unhappy faces are happy again. And uh, we can continue building on. Um, upgrade, 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 and upgrade. Perfect. Ha! Okay. Um, that I, I'm kind of leaning towards this being resolved. 
so the the traffic issues here so i'm gonna leave it leave it on a good note i'm gonna finish off the episode here and uh, we'll address other issues oh i thought it was happy days unfortunately yeah it looks like it's increasing uh we're gonna have to uh, tackle the health issue in the next episode guys i do hope you enjoyed this one if you did press the like button give me some suggestions what would you like to see i think i miss neglected this area here and i'm probably gonna try to do something more about this area here uh housing housing problem everywhere this looks like dublin now uh housing problems everywhere health issues uh probably cemetery or so we'll see we'll see anyway guys uh thank you for watching like subscribe and i'm gonna see you in the next one bye bye